Printing has come such a long way. We've now gotten to a time where we can imagine anything we want in the world, model it, and press print, and get that object in front of us in a physical 3D form. 3D printing has come a long way ever since it really hit mainstream enthusiasts a few years ago, and it is going to keep getting more and more advanced until everything we lay our hands on will be 3D printed. If you're unfamiliar with 3D printing, I'll give you a 30 second rundown. The printer creates extremely thin layers of plastic that is fused together one layer on top of another until it starts to become a 3D object. It's like when you have a bunch of post-it notes together and they are extremely thin, but when you stack them together, they're a cube, right? It's the same concept, only with plastic, and the layers come together to form a more complex shape than just cubes. But what if we could print out something other than hard materials like plastics? What if we could print out stuffed animals? The engineers at Disney join forces with Cornell University and Carnegie Mellon to develop what essentially 3D prints in thin pieces of felt. Now, looking at pictures and videos of what this thing does, it is more of a cutting machine that cuts out shapes of fabric layer by layer to form the end result. So it isn't exactly a 3D felt printer, but it is close enough. It isn't exactly the best alternative to the industrial standard for creating stuffed animals, but we very well might see these crude objects get more and more precise until we have a new form of creating toys. So tell me what you think. Do you think this is a good idea? Could you see in the future looking at a toy and it saying printed in China instead of made in China? Share your thoughts in the comment section below, and don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you guys next time.